Salut tout le monde and welcome back to the Galiga Sisters channel. Today I have a very short unboxing for you. I just received my first subscription box ever. I've never subscribed to any subscription boxes yet and I wanted to start slowly and I like Sephora, I like the products they generally have. So I wanted to try this one for a while and see which samples I get every month to see if I'm gonna keep it or not. I didn't open the box, I don't know which product I have. Before I do the unboxing, please don't forget to subscribe to our channel and like this video, we would really appreciate it. And without further ado, let's start! So when you open, you have the 50 Beauty Insider points that you can use in a shop. So this is the April 2018 box. And I think you have the information about the product, but I'm not gonna read it, otherwise I'm gonna know what's inside. So the theme for this month is Insta Beauty. And everything comes in this little bag. I actually like the material on this one. I feel normally it's like satin finish and a weird finish. Like it's real material. Uh, must be like cotton or something. And it is written, make it snappy on it. So let's open it and see what we got. First product is by Fresh and it is the Lotus Yours Preserve Rescue Mask. So I'm actually very happy about this one because I have uh, received a sample of their cream and I love it. It's very good and I'm actually thinking of buying it for myself. So it has seaweed inside, okay, and looks like it's a classic sample. Let's see. Okay, yeah, it's like the cream sample I received and I'll definitely try because I love this uh, this product, the Lotus line, and yeah, I'm excited about this one. Next one is by Purity, and it's a moisturizer, ultralight moisturizer, okay, with vitamins, antioxidants, and natural oils. Okay, I'm always happy to receive skincare, to be honest. I know some people don't really like it, they want more makeup, but I love skincare, I love trying new face cream and masks, so I'm also happy and I actually never tried Purity before, so I'll definitely give it a go. Next one, by Makeup Forever, Ultra HD Perfector Blurring Skin Tint with Sunscreen. Okay, cool. I don't really like foundation so anything that's light is for me it's a shade number eight so i hope it's matching me i don't know i feel i feel it's not gonna match me mm, yeah it looks a bit dark in my opinion maybe when i'm done yeah i think it's definitely too dark okay i'll still wait and see probably when i'm done next product i have look like a perfume sample by elizabeth and james and it's nirvana Nugget, peony, musk, white, let's smell. I like also receiving perfume sample because it makes me explore new scents. I have my favorites and I'm very much like still on my favorite. I don't really try new fragrances. So let's see. It's very fresh and light. But like the, I think it's a maggot. Maybe a bit too strong for me. I think it's perfect for spring. It's not really my style. I prefer less floral and more sweet probably than that. But yeah, the more I smell it, the more I wait, you know, to diffuse, the less I like it. So, okay. Next one, ooh, by Urban Decay I Shine Ultra Cushion Lip Gloss. I wonder which color I got. It's part of their new release, so I haven't tried either. Okay, I got a very pink one. I wonder which one. Oh, I got the holographic one, of course. <laughs> um, okay, I don't know. I would have preferred a more wearable color, but... It doesn't look that crazy in the bottle, but let's see. It feels thick. And it smells like mint. 
yeah, very strong mint. I don't really like mint scent, but okay. So this is the color. I hope you can see. It's like a bit holographic, very shiny. It has glitter in it. I would have to try it. It has like a very pink reflect, but it's not as bad as I thought it was gonna be, so I'm still excited. And last one is by Peter Thomas Ross, and it is a skin to die for. No filter, mattifying primer and complexion perfector. Okay, I have their, you know, their mask kit. I actually like them, so I'll probably try it under a new foundation or something that I'm trying and see how it works. So that was it for this month's box. I don't know how you feel about it. Me, I'm just happy that I got skincare. I feel I'll never be disappointed with skincare, to be honest. And I'm happy to have the new Urban Decay Gloss to try. I'm not sure about the tint by Makeup Forever, just because of the color. I feel I need to wait a little bit more. And the primer, okay, it's not one of the products I really use every day, so I'm like, mm, you know. And the perfume, no, I don't think it's for me. I'll probably use it still when I'm not going out and I want to smell something, but not for me. I hope you enjoy. Please let me know in the comment section below if you have tried any of these products and what you thought about it. Please don't forget to subscribe to our channel as well. On the next video, I'll be doing my first impression on a full face using only a Makeup Revolution product. So be sure to check it out on Thursday. And we'll see you in our next video. À la prochaine!